Unit 2. Procedure for obtaining work permits. This unit is designed to introduce the procedure and condition for obtaining work permit in Cyprus to the learners. After acquiring knowledge from this unit, learners will be qualified to recognize difference between work and residence permit and the certificate of work registration in Cyprus, inform and or lead foreign citizen through process of obtaining temporary work and residence permit. Introduction Foreign citizens can work in Cyprus based on a work and residence permit. Residence and employment permits are granted mainly on a temporary basis and for a specified work position. 1. Employment of EU citizens. European Union citizens and family members who are also citizens of a member state should submit the application for the issue of a registration certificate within four months from the date of entry into the Republic. For the issue of a registration certificate the Union citizen must submit the following documents. 1.1 If the purpose of residing in the Republic of Cyprus is employed activity. A. Valid passport or identity card and copies of the same. B. Confirmation of engagement by the employer, part 3 of the application, or certificate of employment. C. Two passport-sized photographs. It is noted that photographs are now captured during the application submission process. If the purpose of residing in the Republic of Cyprus is self-employed activity. A. Valid passport or identity card and copies of the same. B. Certificate of registration to the Social Security Services as self-employed. C. Two passport-sized photographs. It is noted that photographs are now captured during the application submission process. 1.2. If the purpose of residing in the Republic of Cyprus is for studying at a private or public educational establishment accredited or financed by the Republic, including vocational training courses. A. Valid passport or identity card and copies of the same. B. Proof of enrollment to study at a private or public educational establishment accredited or financed by the Republic, including vocational training courses. C. Proof of comprehensive health insurance cover in the Republic. D. Declaration or other equivalent means, as the applicants may choose, to assure that they have sufficient resources for themselves and their family in order not to become a burden on the social assistance system of Cyprus during their period of residence. E. Two passport-sized photographs. It is noted that photographs are now captured during the application submission process. 1.3. If the purpose of residing in the Republic of Cyprus is other than the above. A. Fixed or adequate income from employment outside the Republic, or B. Fixed or adequate income from other legal sources, or C. Adequate deposits in financial institutions in the Republic or abroad, and D. Proof of comprehensive health insurance in the Republic. 2. Third country nationals. A. Temporary residence permits for third country nationals, general employment. The procedure for applying for a temporary residence permit for third country nationals is the following. The application MGEN2 or MNSP2, if single permit procedures don't apply, for the issue of entry and temporary residence and employment permit, is submitted by the employer, to the Civil Registry and Migration Department through the appropriate District Office of the Aliens and Immigration Unit of the Police or at the Central Offices of the Civil Registry and Migration Department in Nicosia. The application should be submitted along with O. The contract of employment certified by the Department of Labor of the Ministry of Employment and Social Insurances, which is the competent department for securing that there are no Cypriots or citizens of member states of the European Union, available or adequately qualified for the specific job or post prior to recommending the employment of third country nationals. The maximum period of stay for third country nationals for the purpose of employment is four years, with the exception of the livestock farming and agriculture sectors where the maximum period has been set to six years. The following third country nationals are exempted from this limitation. O highly skilled personnel employed in companies with turnover of more than a million or hundreds of thousands euros and with activities within the priorities set for economic development. O athletes and coaches of individual or team sports. O religious icon painters, until the completion of a specific project. O journalists correspondents. 
O Syrian nationals of Cretan descent, Kurdish, approved catalogues. O homogeneous third country nationals. 3. Employment of non-EU citizens at companies of foreign interests. Eligible companies which fulfill the conditions described in the first chapter may employ third country nationals in the following positions. A. Directors. B. Middle management executives and other key personnel. C. Support staff. Please note that companies should not commit themselves to employing third country nationals for all the following positions before securing a temporary residence and employment permit from the Civil Registry and Migration Department, CRMD. The procedure is as follows. Fill in all the required documents. You can find the documents here. For the full requirements please read the document BCS documents for checking company suitability here. From the list of accompanying documents, choose the one that meets your needs, depending on which permit permits you will apply for. After studying the list of accompanying documents for both the company's suitability and for obtaining a permit, collect the documents you need to submit. Fill in and sign any other forms that may have to accompany the application. Fill in all the fields of the application form and sign it. Beware of the parts requiring signatures from third parties. Submit the application and the documents to the central offices of the Civil Registry and Migration Department. Attention to the documents that need to be submitted in their original form and duly validated certified. Where the conditions foreseen in the law are met, the third country national is granted a temporary residence and employment permit. The validity of the permit depends on the duration of the employment contract and can be up to two, two, years, with a right of renewal. Directors, middle management executives and other key personnel may reside in the Republic without a time limit, provided they hold a valid temporary residence and employment permit. For support staff, the restrictions applicable to the general employment of third country nationals in the Republic apply. Know that all public documents issued abroad must bear an official translation into Greek or English from Press and Information Office. b. Be certified with apostille if the country has signed the Hague Convention of 1961 or certified by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of the country of origin of the applicant and then by the Embassy Consulate of Cyprus in his country or the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of the country of origin of the applicant and then the Embassy Consulate of his country in Cyprus and then certified by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Cyprus. In the instance that the country of origin of the applicant has not signed the Hague Convention of 1961 and there is no embassy consulate in the above-mentioned country the documents must be certified by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of the country of origin of the applicant and then the nearest embassy consulate which is accredited to Cyprus. Since regulations are changing rapidly, FDI advisors should check the data on the provided web pages, or directly contact the relevant stakeholders, before giving any information or starting the permit, S. Procedure for Foreign Investors.